Terra Luna Classic has had some good recent updates. I wanna get you guys up to speed with some of these updates. So if you guys appreciate these updates, make sure to smash the thumbs up button. If you guys are new to the channel, you guys like Terra Luna Classic updates, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell. And uh, as always, not financial advice, but I hope you guys are enjoying the journey so far. And uh, one thing you guys know with Terra Luna Classic, we are in a phase right now where we are waiting for development to finish for this cryptocurrency. And uh, you guys can see the price. For the last seven days, we've actually stayed within this 10,000 range on the coin market cap charts you guys can see right here the volume has decreased a little bit just recently it's been hovering around the 12 million the 11 million dollar particularly on Binance and some of the other crypto exchanges but once I think this development is finished that we're going to talk about I expect this volume to increase as well but what are some of the big updates we've had just recently so have a look at this tweet I saw this we have 85 active validators fully committed to the Luna Classic chain each has kept their lights on during a time of limbo nothing but love for these folks they could have just shut shop they kept the chain alive i thank them all so you guys can see right here the validators have done a 180 on luna classic so you guys know in the past the validators were against a lot of these changes but they've actually come to the party now they are supporting luna classic we have 33 projects coming to luna classic in the future and this is a really good signal for luna classic so good to see these active validators support this crypto as it develops right now on top of that we also have some big updates about Binance so you guys know Binance CZ here's at the centerpiece of uh, Luna, Luna Classic and the potential price movements of this cryptocurrency so you guys are aware what can potentially happen at the end of all this development this ecosystem build out is CZ he could potentially come to the party he could do a 1.2 percent burn of the Binance volume on their crypto exchange so that would be extremely bullish for the volume for the burn for the price of Luna Classic that is something that is potentially out there for Luna Classic down the road and on top of that you guys also may be aware that Binance itself holds a ton of Luna Classic so you guys can see right here Binance main wallet just surpassed 2.7 trillion Luna Classic that's almost 40% of the total supply what will happen around August 26 when staking and delegation on validators is re-enabled and uh, you guys can see this cartoon from Luna Classic validator over on Twitter and it's an interesting question so people want to know exactly what is Binance doing is that 2.7 trillion is that owned by the users of Binance or is that you know CZ's secret stash could he possibly Possibly burn up a ton of that Luna Classic if you could you could watch out for some uh, bullish price movements right there on top of that you guys can see right here a tweet from happy caddy crypto is picked up in the discord TFL has requested changes on our pull request you can see everything in the discussion on github so why is this good so this is good because Terra Luna Classic is getting support from the original developers the original support of Luna okay so they're working hand in hand they are helping to update some of this development as we're kind of patiently waiting out these changes and that is good to see so that is another fresh update straight out of the discord and on top of that where are we up to with the burn right now so we have crossed the 2 billion range we are up to around 2 billion and 51 million we know there are a ton of projects helping to support the burn of Luna Classic so a lot of people from a lot of different crypto projects exchanges small exchanges big exchanges and also NFT projects you guys name it lots of people are burning up Luna Classic right now so it's crossed 2 billion but we do need to get this way way higher in the future so we do need to get Luna Classic up to around the 6 trillion burn range and that will massively reduce the supply you guys know the theories of demand and supply so again if the supply gets evaporated gets burnt up for Luna Classic it could have some very potentially exciting price movements as well and if we do bring up the price graph for the last few weeks to say the least right here you guys can see we have had a bit of an increase from around the 8,000, 9,000 level. We actually did get up to around the 11,000 level right here with a big increase in volume at the start of uh, August. And uh, right now we're kind of consolidating around this 10,000 range. So what am I thinking right now? I think the market is just waiting. I think a lot of holders out there are waiting for the development of Luna Classic. So we're waiting for the Terror Rebels team to implement all these changes to kick off the ecosystem to get these 33 projects in here. And uh, that is going to really kind of energize the Luna Classic ecosystem. So we do want to see the ecosystem get developed, get up and running right now. And I think everyone is uh, patiently waiting for this one to really explode uh, in 
in the future. And uh, if we do take a look at the broader crypto prices today, what are the crypto prices up to? You guys can see right here, there's been a few couple of big winners. Weird, Celsius is up 30% right there. And uh, some of the other cryptos are up. And uh, what is Bitcoin doing? So we have talked about Bitcoin. I'm probably going to do another big crypto news update after this one as well. But Bitcoin is looking strong around the $23,000 level and uh, Ethereum's looking good. A lot of the other cryptos are looking good today, guys. So good stuff in the crypto market. And again, we're kind of warming up out of the bear market to some degree. I do want to see Bitcoin go to $25,000 and hold that line as well. And uh, if you guys are interested, and if you guys are interested, I am doing uh, weekly updates in the Patreon, also buy alerts and, uh, you know, pre-sales coming up, pre-sales strategy, making money in the crypto space. So if you guys like making money, you guys can go uh, check out the Patreon as well. But guys, that's a big update for Lunar Classic for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smash the thumbs up button. I appreciate you guys tuning in and I'll see you guys in the next one. Crypto Zeus signing out.